Hello everyone, I'm American Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Victoria 2, playing as, well, America. And last time we took a bunch of territory from France. Uh, that feels good. But anyways, uh, last time we did get into the supposed Great War, so now we can't really go to war with anyone for a while, which is fine. It gives us time to build up more of our military. It gives us time to get a little bit more money as a stockpile, because, well, we lost about half of our stockpile yesterday. We're now about 4 million pounds. But I do want to talk about, like, Europe a little bit. It just dawned on me that Corsica exists now. Of course, Brittany was here last time at the end of last episode. Uh, Italy still has Savoy, which makes sense. Germany still owns the Ardennes or or whatever. Uh, Romania has more Austro-Hungarian territory. Serbia became a little bigger. And Poland also took some territory off of the Austrians. Oh, they're actually allied with the Germans. Oh, huh. that's... Uh, and I, I guess I just accepted an alliance from them. Which is very good. I would love to go to war with these guys right now, but we cannot. Unfortunately, cannot. Also, we have a lot of war exhaustion, so we are maxed out. So it's probably a good thing that we're not going to go to war just yet. Look at that money that we're making. Beautiful. Please let it go down. Please let the war exhaustion go down. Peace plus 50. Um, yeah, this really hurts our organizational regain. <clears throat> the Treaty of Vienna for uh, Austria-Hungary. That is, that is not good. Yeah, that's really not good. International isolation. Sanctions. Whatever. I don't care about that stuff, you know. Hmm. Well, let's lower taxes. Uh, I can lower spending maybe by a little bit. Let's drop this. Now, we're not going to be making nearly as much money, but that's... No, that's still not bad. The 16th Nobel Prize in Physics. A great honor for the city of physics in our nation. Absolutely. Drop tariffs. Now, we're making less money. But that should make everyone else a little bit more wealthier. State of emergency. Wait, why would we want a state of emergency now? Um, no, we good. I'm good, man. I'm good. Civil violence intervene eventually, of course. And, yeah, I don't think the war exhaustion is going to be dropping. I don't think there's going to be very much that we can do. No more war. Reconquista blockaded. Yeah, some of this is actually, it looks like it's a little glitch. Tara Alka? Via? Wait, hold on. Let's, let's look at one of these provinces. Resistencia. Oops. This isn't Hoi 4. I can't press F and do that. So you guys are... Oh! So these blo places are blocked. Oh. Hmm. I... Hmm. Can I give that to Argentina just so that we can, uh... Like, get rid of this war exhaustion? Claim Mali. That'd be kind of cool. Release nations. Yeah, I don't think I will. Honduras. Yeah, no. Well, that sucks. <clears throat> Which means... What I should do... To get rid of that, actually... Is to go to war... With Argentina... And take Etra Rios. So this way it'll be connected to the sea, and then I can get connected right there. That's not a bad idea. But that is the next target after Mexico. Awesome. I'm glad we came up with this, my friends. I'm glad we came up with it. Let's see. Are we building any more? Yes, we are. That's very good. Keep building? We're only third in industry, which sucks. Because we had to shut down some of these places. I mean, I don't mind doing something like this. Alaska? No, you gotta make sure that's still open. Oh, man, there's a lot of people in Alabama. Oh, we'll definitely keep this open, too. That's really necessary. And, eh, you get some of this, too. That's fine. <clears throat> awesome. Industry's done. Culture. Well, we can still do, still do some stuff still there. Uh, it's probably good to focus on the Navy. Bigger naval base. That's a pretty good idea. Fascist soup kitchens. Uh, sure. Sure, why not? You know, just because they isolated us doesn't mean that we should not lower our war exhaustion. I don't think I necessarily agree with that. It'd be mobilizing. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, Serbia is pretty large. Hungary is there. Romania, Poland got pretty thick. Czechoslovakia looks normal. Austria, they don't even have Sud Tyrol. Holy cow. Wow. Oh, hey! And we just saw Yugoslavia flip. Oh, communists. Oh, communists. Oh, how I will put you all down. Nice to go do that. You guys looking pretty darn okay. Maybe not great, but you're doing better. Human resource development. 
military aviation. That's awesome. That's looking pretty good. We also need to build up another task force, probably. Yep. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There you go. A couple more troop ships. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Cool. Should be good. We might go over our foursomes just by a little bit, but not very much. So I guess there's a lot of communists in Wisconsin, Illinois, and just little portions of the Midwest and up uh, and California. Uh, yeah, you guys can do this too. Good, good, good. Of course, of course. Let's. Hey, look. How many Dixie and Yankees are down here in Coahuila? It's not even American Core, the game to the Sinks 6 Olympiad. Very good. Uh oh. Oh boy, what's what's going on, UK? You're still fighting over that dirt patch over there. Why do you have to mobilize for that? You're literally, like, first in the world or something? Yeah, in industry, second in the military behind me. Unconstitutional, that's good. Losing a little bit of money probably because we had to kill a lot of people, because of the communists. That's okay. Um, yeah, sure, if you want to. Oh, that does not look good. Just a little bit more tariffs. There we go. Just a lot, tiny bit. Not, not, not too much more. Not too much more. I mean, I still see people that are hurting here. We still need to help them out a little bit. Oh, New York is looking... Oh, some of the factories went bye-bye, too. Wow, that is not... Oh, that's not good. Ohio? No, uh, definitely I have to have this. You guys looking okay? Get some steel in Pennsylvania. That'd be good. Maybe make a little bit more money. We're really not making much money at all, which makes sense. Let's see. We've got planes. It, I'm putting on the government budget because I need planes. Artillery will be important as well as this. Special projects. Sure, try that. Railroads, West Indies. Oh, I have one of the West Indies. That's nice. So, oh. There's militant socialists in France, Italy, UK. So immigration-wise, no one's coming to America because they all uh, said no to me. Hmm. Now, I can't really go to war either. That really doesn't make any sense. Like, if I'm at peace by myself, this shouldn't be happening. Let's see, no more... Oh, what? Where's, what's the modifier for no more war? Monthly war exhaustion. It'll last until 1919. Okay, that's good. it lasts until May 1919, which is fine with me. Uh, we do want to go to war with these guys. We actually want to break them up a little bit more. Sweden? Sure. Shogun of Japan? Yes. Germany? Yes. Russia? Sure. All right, so how's the military looking? Not too bad, not too bad. We need an armor piece and infantry. So with planes, I think now I don't need any more horses because horses are kind of they're kind of done. So good. Oh wow, they're just injured. That's all. That's good. Not bad, not bad. Oh, ships? We make some ships? God, I hope so. Hmm. Okay, so probably here's the plan. When I can go to war, I'm going to go to war with Argentina and take out this state so this is no longer blockaded. This is costing me quite a bit. I wish there was a way you could give territory to your allies. I really wish there was a way. Alright, so... Uh... Are you guys from here? No, you're from Mexico. You guys are coming back down to Panama. If that's the case. Uh, one, two. Get a plane. And then some armor. And another infantry. There you go. Ambrose is dead. Tension six eight. There's a lot of anger directed at us, which yeah, make, yeah, might, might make a little bit of sense, you know. Considering that we have a ton of infamy, just not any infamy. Hey, communists! Wow, that's a lot of communists. But they're not in my capital, so I don't really care. Ah, good. Oil driven chips? Yes, please. Up, oh, and we're over our naval limits. 
but barely. We're barely over our limits. Barely over that cell. Not really too worried about it. Actually, what does that do? Penalty to supplying them. Okay. That's okay. Once we raise up our enable bases, it'll be fine. Oh, there goes a the budget, too. Ooh. Hey, look. Now that's a lot of commies. Uh, where did that army go? Uh, let's see. We can raise taxes just a little bit more. Just a little bit. Help things out a little bit. Well, I mean... We're killing a lot of communities. Very nice. Very nice. Wow, we really don't have a lot of money. Then again, naval ports. I assume are very expensive. Yeah, they're like $200,000. So many dead. So violence intervene eventually. Forward. Uh, sure. How great. Alright. Hey, Canada's helping him out. Thank you, Canada. Ohio. Well, let's grab some of that. Nice. How about the people from Ohio just a little bit? Santiago, let's get another infantry. Alright, not bad. Oh wow, Mexico's got a lot of commies too. Yeah, colonizing this place was not a great idea. Really not a great idea. That's really hurting us. Uh, oh. Oh, we can go to war. Good, good. Mm, I'm probably just going to go do this. Wow, 800 days. Holy crap. Yeah, I'll do that just because we need them. Disperse them. Wow, we're losing money at the wazoo. Ah, socialist, put him down, put him down. What is that? Chaos and South. Oh, wait, I own South Madagascar? No, we were found out. Oh, well. No one cares. Uh, let's see. You guys come down there. That'd be good. Wow, we're losing some serious money here. Alright, so what's the most expensive thing? Is it really military? Oh, look, our naval force limits are okay. Republican Party. Hmm, they're not making much money. Let's see. I think it's just the naval stuff. We'll be back. Oh, Algeria has freed themselves. Oh, I have so many rebels over here. What am I even doing? What am I even doing? I didn't even realize this. That's my fault. That's completely my fault. So we'll take out Algeria. Oh, who's going to war? British control, Italian restoration. Ah, oh, makes sense. I mean, at this point, I really don't understand this at all. Like, yeah, people are pissed off and stuff, but why is it all just communists? Is that all America has? Are just commies? Like you have, you guys get food. You guys get, you know, what you really need. And Molly's back and free. Okay. Well, you know what? Just go ahead and declare war on them. Uh, humiliate. Screw that. We're gonna take them out right now. God dang! It, I can't do anything. Parliamentary agitation. Oh, we'll go with that one. Wow. My officer score has gone way down. Well, yeah, let's get back up. We'll get Molly. We'll get all of them. Uh, fine. We'll humiliate you. That's fine for now. But we're going to do the same thing to Molly. So. 
Yeah, getting this much infamy really kind of sucks. Because it... Hmm... Because I have too much war exhaustion. There's nothing I can do with war exhaustion. That is not a very good mechanic for that war exhaustion thing right there. Blockaded home ports. International... Honestly, international isolation really shouldn't hurt you that bad for war exhaustion. That does... N that really is, not, in my mind, not very smart to do. Um, international isolation. Hmm. The blockaded stuff. Hmm, I don't know about that. But hey, it's a good lesson for me to learn. It's a very good lesson for me to learn when playing a Vicky 2. What happened? Whatever. Take him out. I'm glad I built at least one army up here. That's kind of nice. Oh, man. There's a lot of guys around here. We get military access? Probably not. That's what I thought. Scoundrels. All of them. Cool. You guys. Hey, let's make it some money. War is a racket. Ah. Customer's always right. And it's going to take us forever to go to war with Argentina. Forever. Call my allies in. They're only 36 scores. So that's not too bad. Uh, hopefully you guys can do well. I hope. Nice. Very good, very good. Yeah, no. You're all gonna die here, man. They can't pierce my armor. Nope. Mission to Argentina. Hmm. That's not enough infamy. <laughs> Cause of freedom, spread the word? Yes. We were discovered. Let's see this leads to anything. Man. Trying to get to the desert really sucks. Yes. Yes. A Pino Colony sounds like a very good thing to have. Come on, guys. Kill them off. You're using literal armor here. We should have no issues with fighting these guys. Alright, alright. Still making just a little bit of money. Good. Let's see, cruiser attack. Ra oh, radio factories. Very nice, very nice. Now, I wonder if there's a way to get rid of this uh, international isolation. Because uh, if I smash all the great powers, does that mean there's no more international isolation? Oh, isolation. Wow, France, you're looking really bad. You're looking a little bit like me. Oh, you have fascism. There, you got some fascists. Austria, you have some fascists as well, huh? That'd be interesting, hmm. Colonial uprisings, very good. And of course, why did, wait, why did Tunisia come out? They're uncivilized. Uh, that's really not worth it. I'm just gonna straight up annex them, probably. Screw Mali, screw all these places. Yeah, it's, this is really difficult, like, International isolation, like I've said, is just, it's too much. It's frankly too much. That's a little unbalanced, but I understand why uh, the devs made it so. Oh, American coffee's pretty good, though. Let's see. Yeah. Good. Good. Oh, wow. There's, why is everyone communist? This makes no sense. It's one thing if you're like socialist, but the ideology is only less than seven percent for communists. We'll be back. All right, my friends. Sorry oh. about that. Oh. But the game crashed on me as soon as the Gambia was uh, released. So we're back here, a little bit back in time. Uh, going to have to deal with some of these uh, bad boys down here. But you know what? What else? What else is new? You know? What else is new? Anyways, let's see. I'm going to take you ships. You ships. You guys. guys. Uh, you guys come over here. Those guys are busy. If some more African countries release... Oh, Tunisia hasn't been released yet, because, yeah, makes sense why. Uh, let's raise tariffs just a little bit more. Raise military spending a little bit more as well. Good. Uh, crucial states. And we got the oil ships back. Ooh, great war experience. Yes, please. It is 1920, so happy year. Happy new year, my friends. Go ahead and just decimate all these people as best you can. We're at war, but what else is new? 
Ah, oh, look, a little over 100 FME. So I did off screen, double check to see, like, how long is, like, the international thingamabobs gonna last? Like, where is it? Politics. International pariah. Eventually that goes away. Or something. In, oh, this goes away in 1933, so we hang on until then. This goes away. So, screw everyone else. So right now, wow. No one really likes the Democrats, I guess. The Conservative Party. Mission to Argentina. Good. So, hey, we could put down all those communists. That's good. Ah, never mind. They just rose back up. Put them down again. Round two. Here we go. So, I'm going to see. We're going to definitely wait until then now. Obviously, I'm going to go to war with other people and stuff like that, but, uh... I really want to see what happens after, like, we get rid of that modifier. That'd be kind of nice to see. Just so that we all know what's going to happen. Good luck over here, guys. Good luck. There's a little bit of prestige. That's okay. I think we're still... Oh, boy. Chaos in Cameroon. Makes sense. I'm surprised Jimmy's not doing anything. Like, taking out Austria or anything like that. Tension dissipate. Oh! Telling liberation of Dalmatia. They're fighting Yugoslavia. Way to beat up on smaller people, UK. <laughs> but I hope you're all doing well. It's 1920 for us. Oh, some guy died. We're having a little bit of troubles. We'll call this time period for the troubles. Ah, there we go. We got more people being released, which isn't very good for us. But we'll get them all back soon enough. Very good, very good. Just stamp them out if you can, please. Thank you very much. You have armor, which means you should really just be steamrolling bodies left and right. Whatever. You know what? It's pretty bad right now. But it's... Could it get worse if we don't declare a statue of... Oh, we can't do this now. What do I have to do? Militancy above four. Anyone is at war, huh? Because that really could help lower our monthly war exhaustion, which would be nice. I never did anything about the native statuses. Can I do anything about that? Do I have any... No? Hmm. Alright, we'll close it then. We can change our border policy. Africa... You guys are busy trying to kill other people, which is good. And... Oh, look. An army. Very good. Uh, I'm going to keep you down. Actually, I'll put you in New Mexico. Let's see, you are going to be the person building all this stuff. So get another army because we're going to have more uprisings probably. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one. Oh, wait, we don't. Eh, get three because it costs quite a bit to build this armor. It costs quite a bit, so. Save a little bit of money, strikes. Whatever. Whatever. Building up naval ports again. People in DC looking pretty communist themselves. If that's the case. We still got rebels in Hispaniola, but what else is new? You guys get on the boat. Come on down here. Take these guys out. Population wise, we are at 126 million. That's not bad. I mean, I really don't understand. How many communists can we have? God dang, this is the 1920s. No wonder there was a red scare. Oh, did I lose somebody again? Uh, not really. Infamy is slowly going down. Super slowly. Oh, Conservative Party. Well, yeah, like I said earlier, I don't think that the uh, those guys are really going to be doing, doing very much. Yeah. Even though I just lost... I can't even think of what I was even saying earlier. Oh, well. It's pretty good looking Romania. Pretty good ro looking Romania. Oh, there they go. Traza. Reduction of prestige. I'm just going to straight up annex you. Your rebellions must be put down. American Free Corps. Uh, ooh. Well, whatever. We still have elections. We're probably going to become socialists, too. Again, probably. Which, you know, could be worse. Could be a lot worse. 
budget wise we're doing okay yeah we're doing okay of course not oh, of course not good work experience good good have your armaments oh tank at light tanks nice Oh, we got the oh, we got, actually got the established protector castle belly. That's gonna be nice. We'll get this stuff this stuff done first. That'd be good. Um, now this makes more sense that they actually would rebel. It's in Panama. No one cares. Good, good, good. A little bit of money. Can we build up maybe another port here, perhaps? Cost us quite a bit, but that's okay. How is Vietnam looking? Eh. Vietnam is actually very, very peaceful. Oh, now we're, wow, we lost so much prestige. We're in second place. Yeah, this game punishes harshly if you go over your infamy limit, which which makes sense. But even then, you should be able to deal with it a little better. All right, let's let time go on as best we can. Watch other nations fall to war for now. Watch. Actually, France got Brittany back. Really, really, man. Oh. Oh. They turned to fascism. They even united with... Okay. Uh, sure. You can fight my armies for me. Fight the rebels. We lost the Congo. Wow. That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. Tensions dissipate. So be it. I'm holding on, though. Until 1933. I'm definitely holding on. Good. So have an army down here. Good to take out these guys. They only have 35 military score. We should do pretty well. God dang it. Mm. Come up here, and then make all the way back down here. Wow. Oh, you don't even have a. Oh. Okay, come on back here. Thank you very much. Uh, oh wow, you got a lot of guys there. Here was looking pretty good, pretty good. Getting some money, clone discontentment. Good. Got some planes, got some tanks on those guys. Very nice. Alright, can I send any other army to, like, Africa? Hopefully. Send you over to here. We're going to go to war with... Uh, I, some of these places I have a, a Cassus Belli Belli to uh, establish protectorate. I'm not sure where it is though. Yeah, we were already at war with those guys. Hold on. Let's check the events. Constantine. Oh, the Germans. In, uh, the, the Germans were at war? Huh. Oh my god, please. At this point, I'm really surprised that, like, communists even have a party. Because the amount of wars they're starting... Hey, I have another army down there. I'm glad I look at that. Oh, you're almost down there. Cool. Come back home. Okay, since that's kind of a waste. I must come to Greenville or Norfolk or something. I mean, they're just rising up to die. They're literally not going to get anything out of this. I love you, Canada. Thank you so much for helping me, man. I'm so glad we got Canada with us. Even more rebels? Wow. Anti-Colonial League, denounce the League, of course, of course. Put them down like the animals they are. Get you guys working there too. And we need another infantry. So many rebels. Do we have any rebels in Vietnam? No, Vietnam is really, really peaceful. God, let's all move to Vietnam, guys. Ottoman Empire. Yeah, they're still going to like us, actually, a little bit. Oh my god, how many more rebels are going to spawn? How many more people will I have to put down? Mission to Argentina. Well, hopefully we'll use our allies to take out Argentina. That's probably the most important thing. Uh, let's see... 
Oh, of course our athletes are victorious. Of course. Oh, come on. Come on. Thank you. I'm actually going to move you guys. Probably... S oh, we got to rescue that army. Go ahead and do that. Good, 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 good. Of course not. Wait, you do not have... Well, god dang it, I just disbanded it. Whatever. Hmm... Come on down here. Oh! Uruguay, you have some rebels too. Oh, you're, you're literal communists. Oh, okay, what, well, whatever. Good, that's done. Divisional structures, very good. Are we done with... We're almost there. And now we can go to war whenever we want, which is good. So we can liberate some of these provinces. Oh my goodness. This is definitely what we need. Yeah, they have a little port there. We're going to go to war immediately just because uh, we need to free that. Let's see. Call allies. Everyone will accept. Good. Immediately come into, like, there or something. Should probably brought another army. Hmm. Navy half strength probably isn't really good either. Let's see. Call ally. Of course. Call all the allies in, even though they didn't really accept. Oh, you're already at war. Which is thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Good. Mm. Give me your armies, Colombia. And so violence. Good. Nice. I've never done it like this. I've literally never done this before. So in half, we need. Two armies. Which actually don't look too bad. Still making a little bit of money. Nice. Oh boy. Are we attacking them? Or are they attacking us? Oh, I think we we're attacking them. What the heck, guys? Oh my goodness. Espionage and Sedition Acts. Uh, ooh. Descent is the lifeblood of free people. Yes. So we have another army. Oh my god, there's so many flipping rebels. I hate all these rebels so much. Go and put those people down. That'd be good. Send you down here. We're going to make more armies anyway, so... I'm actually going to put you over here. Good. I like that. Ah, Colombian soldiers, good. And... Good. Go straight for the capital if we can. Another army, good. <clears throat> suppression, a little bit of suppression here and there. Good. Awesome. Oh, we got the capital. Love it. Ah, Canada's here to help. Great. Oh, we fleet up some enemy ships. Very nice. Mercedes. Good. Excellent. Building up another army? Yes, we shall. So. Six. Six, seven, there we go. Hopefully that'll work. You guys are doing well, you guys come over there. I'm going to send you back up to Panama, just in case. Lafayette McClellan. Still number greatest, we are the greatest military power still here. Oh good, thank you Peru. God, I love having allies. You know what, since we're here... Oh, we don't. We can't have another war goal. I was just going to pop at them too. That would be kind of actually very nice. I would say the war, the war, my friends, is going well enough for us to get another war goal. Perhaps, maybe, maybe not. Argentina. Wait, we loan stuff to Argentina. We're fighting them. Hmm. Very nice. Very nice. Nope. Nice. 
nice. And, oh, we could, oh, repay debts? Yes, I like that. All right, Columbia, you can have your people back. Thank you very much. Oh, you, oh, that's not good. They're ninth in the, they're ninth in the world? Hmm, maybe we should have deleted their units. <laughs> oh, your reactionary is nice. Very good. They might break free of our rule, which I, which is I really don't like. I'm gonna send you guys back because you guys are looking a little injured. Holy, you really? Did you? Oh, they mobilized. That's why, probably. And Argentina. Make a puppet. Oh, we can't do that. Oh, no, no. That sucks. That really sucks. Try it again. Actually, can we humiliate them. That that really sucks. So be it. So be it. Not bad. Thank you, my friends. Defaults in defiance of our military. Cut down to size. Hey, here we go. Nice. We actually freed this group. Now, does that give us more war exhaustion? Oh, we're over. Oh my god. So now we got rid of some of that war exhaustion. Now it should go. Maybe. Oh, it went down to fifty. That's good. But let's let's do this first. We got some rubble still. Makes it. Oh. We're still doing this stuff over here, which makes some sense. Uh, since we're here, let's do that, do that, do that. We can build some railroads, that'd be kind of nice. And, let's see, you guys. Infantry, planes, infantry. Eh, we don't need two planes, get some armor too. Armor, infantry, good. Build up the roads there. We're doing okay. <clears throat> oh man, my voice is going down. All right, you guys looking good. Let's go head on back up to Tampa. This is a little bit too big of an army. Mm, good enough for, for now. Nice. <clears throat> Excuse me. Canada, thank you very much for helping me in all of my wars. I really like Canada now. That's a case. War exhaustion is still not going down. We need to get Narma Taruka Tindu. Well, colonies again. Hmm. What happens when we go to war? We get wait. We can dismantle fascist Mexico. Huh. Hmm. I still want to do that. Even with so much war exhaustion. Fascist trade unions. Declare the union illegal. That probably pisses people off. Become more socialist. Uh, I don't want more socialism in my country. That's right. We just casually put down these mass rebellions every, every year. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is just insane. Even though, at this point, it's not going to be that bad since... Uh, yeah, I have a lot of armies around here, really, just to massacre these communist, socialists, fascists. It doesn't matter, just put them all down. Maybe except for this. If that's the case, you guys get in the boat. Head on over here. That's a problem over there, too. But we'll deal with it soon enough. But I'm glad that's no longer blockaded. Uh, I'm thinking, I'll probably take out Brazil. So we can get get to these areas quickly. I, I really wish it was a button that we could like just give this territory away. That just makes sense. Like we can sell territory. That, that does that not make sense? Then again, this is a game. This is an older game, so. Uh, Grau Para. If I could take two states off this country, that'd be really really beneficial. To, or if I just puppet them. No, even if I puppet them, it still won't do very much for us. Excelente. Oh wow. Parts of Indiana, Ohio are cut down. I mean, regardless, wait, you can't be losing that battle. There's no way. Go and help them out as well. As we're going to build up another army group. Oh, we got one armor. 
Get some of that. Get some of this. Uh, I'm sorry, UK. You can't tell. I'm having a little bit of a rebel problem right now. There's a crisis going on. Auto Ottoman. Oh, nice. I like this. The Germans, Ottomans, Dutch, Dutch, UK, and Italy. Oh wait, who's helping me? Haiti. Oh no. Oh boy, I'm gonna be fighting a lot of people. I'm gonna be fighting a lot of people. To hell with you, no way. Oh, well, I guess we're gonna end that episode here. If you enjoyed today's episode, consider leaving a like. <laughs> Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow as we put down more Americans and pretty much probably gonna fight the entire world. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.